Hello everybody, I'm Storm here, and welcome back to Transport Fever. In the last episode, we finished up the first leg of our new Northern Rail passenger route between Insomnia and I'm not recalling the name of the towns at the moment. But we began the first leg. I'll go look at the towns. Before we put uh, these diesel multi-units on this line to see how they are eventually going to go. Oh, new stuff. Oh, Shinkansen. Okay, the first, I think the original bullet trains. And we got a bunch of Boeing 727s, which um, we have no airports. We might get around to airports at some point. I'll have to figure that out. All right, so the lines were actually... Uh, Insomnia, Lake Armstrong, and Vice City. So that's running here. You're not carrying any passengers yet. We are getting passengers waiting. Ten passengers. Alright, so it's it's starting to come up. City's building in this area. Alright, so that's that's good. That's good. Uh, we have two other um, things we've got to sort out at some point. is Duckburg and King's Landing way out there. Um, so, yeah. I think we might need to change this from a terminal station to a through station. Don't know how we're going to make that work. That'll be a project for another time. We are raking in money pretty effectively now. Um, $40 million a year. So that is good. If we take a look at our financials in terms of balance, our new trains that we just installed are the ones losing money. Again, not unexpected. Um, this freight, a couple of freight lines, but again, those are necessary to make a bunch of other freight lines work. Trams, worker buses, again, not really worried about that as far as losing money. Our lumber that is, you know, our train that's carrying logs, lumber, um, and now plastic is making just absolutely tons of money, which is good. And then we have our oil line. The backbone is making very nice money. So yeah, everything is looking pretty good. So we're just gonna continue working on this passenger line and get this in. And then, uh, yeah, let's see how we're going to go from here. So we're in Vice City. We're going to have to head out to Floston. And then eventually Alda over here. All right. And so what we're prob probably going to need to do is uh, a rather significant bit of bridge work to get out to Floston. And I'm not exactly sure how I'm going to want to sort this. Um, well, let's just start um, laying in some track, or starting to prototype in some track, and uh, we'll see what it does. Let's see, if I wanted to come out of here straight and level for a stretch. Tenery. We might think about it. Because now we have the bullet trains. But for now, we're going to say no. Okay, that's not bad. But we are going to start knocking some stuff down here. Um...
Yep, it's fine. Let's put it in. Bridge pillar collision. On what? Then just remove the... This is one thing that I hope that they improve upon a little bit in the next version, or the next game, is, uh... Well, there's a bunch of things. And, uh, bridge pillar placement is probably one of them. Because, I mean, what's it doing here? All right, so there's our diamond. You see, for whatever reason, that works. That is a very tight turn. Without ripping the guts out of this city? I don't see any other option here. Looks like I might need to rip the guts out of the city. Alright. See, I don't necessarily want the, the continue to hook on that radius. So we're going to have to bring it out to like, to like this point here where it'll, it'll let me do it. Actually, I want to get it to right about, see, I want to kind of do it there. All right, do it. Okay, so now we need to put things back. Which is not going to be simple. All right, we need to reconnect the tram in some way, shape, or form. I think this may need to get torn out. And this as well. Eh, the city will rebuild.
All right, get that stop back in there. See, the thing is, I kind of ripped the guts out of the uh, residential areas, which is not exactly ideal. But we still should be okay. of ah oh, well I'm doing it so might as well continue all right mm. come on you just want to be like that yes there we go okay you can make the loop good all right, now as far as like the small roads. That can come through there. Oh, this is gonna have to. Um, probably swing around like that. And there you are. All right. Well, actually, let's go ahead and make that medium street. Okay. So, uh, yeah, that city's got a lot of work to do. here and we're gonna kind of uh, just shoot across here and then we're gonna need a bridge to come up to here and then start heading in the direction of Floston now we do have a bit of a ridge here so we might need a little bit of tunnel and probably to rework that road a bit that's okay. Whoa, that's not what I was looking for. Hmm. Can I increase the height of that bridge just a little bit to let some ships through, assuming we ever actually use ships? Yes. All right, let's get the right kind of bridge in there. All right. 12 million. Oh, Tram 29 has reached his lifetime and should be replaced. Tram 29? What route are you on? The Kakariko Village Tram. Oh, you're not set up to replace anything? Okay. Replace now. Yes. Auto replace on. Done and done. All right. See, the thing is, that road probably won't let any ships underneath. Construction materials, goods. Hmm. Let's get rid of that road temporarily, and then let's get 
that track through there. So where in Floston are we going to get a station in so that we can continue on to Ulda here? Now that I have tons and tons of money in the bank, part of me wants to just rip a hole right through the center of town as the best option. So that we can keep this, the train basically heading straight through here and then proceed on the older. Yeah, I think that's what we're gonna do. All right. So, we're gonna need to make a slot for the station. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Okay. Probably even get rid of that. All right. This is going to be fine, I think. Come on. Oh. Wrong buttons. All right. Let's uh, smooth all that out. Alright, now, here's hoping that a station will actually go through there. Okay. So... We're going to be doing two tracks. It's not going to have electrification on it right now. It's going to be high speed, 200 meters long. It's going to have the 1920s design on it. And we're going to want... End street connections. Both. We want end street? No, 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 no. We don't want end street. We want main street on both. Okay. Alright, so there is. We're going to drop it in right about there. Okay. Because I think I can make this work. I don't want to knock out that entire piece of... piece of road. Um... I do want to knock it back a little bit. Like perhaps right about there. Alright, well, it's gonna go. Uh, okay. We can get that in there in the right arc. Okay. And then you are going to connect through to there. Too much slope. Where's too much slope? B 
building will be removed. No. There we are. Too much slope. What is causing too much slope? Oh, probably that. All right then, bye bye. Okay, so there we go. This is the road that's coming into town. I wanted to connect through to there. You to connect through to there. And then I want you to tunnel underneath the station. There you go. Okay. And let's get Let's get the rails connected. Oh, except we now have a bridge I need to, need to remove because didn't realize there was a, a bit of bridge that went in there. And for this, I think just a little bit of that kind of bridge should be fine. All right. So, we want to get another piece of road to kind of cross through here. Can I get construction not possible? What's not possible about the construction? think that will work. All right. Oh, we have an intersection inside of a tunnel. That isn't going to happen. No, that that just doesn't work. Uh neither does that apparently. Okay, that'll have to do. Okay. So there's the town. And right now, this station covers what little residential is left after I, you know, massacred that city. All right. So I think we're going to go ahead and unpause that. And what I'm going to do is we're going to take the line. I think we're going to rename this train passenger um, um Caught the high northern route. Okay. 
Because then we're going to take you, right? And you stop at Vice City. And then we're going to add... Floston to that. Oh, we need to put uh, we need to put signals on there, and then you're gonna come back to Vice City. All right. But uh, signals, signals. Okay. Five should be on Terminal Two. Three should be on Terminal One, which it is. Okay, good. And signals. Okay. As far as vehicles are concerned, let's see, where are they? You are there, you are there. Alright, I'm gonna want to wait, I think, until that train. It's kind of in between Lake Armstrong and Vice City. All right, and then let's go ahead and buy some trains. And there's the auto save. We have these guys. Which ones were we were we putting on this line? I don't quite remember which one we did. Uh, let's see. How many passengers can this thing hold? Ninety-four. Which will be 47 per train. So it is you. Let's put a third train on there. Man, Trucks, Volvo Vikings, Alco C628, another one of these. Three hundred and ninety. 
16 car sets. Um, I wish you would tell me how long it was. Six car sets. 140 passengers. 6,000 horsepower. Why are they so cheap? Because they cost tons per year to maintain. Okay, interesting. All right, well, I think we're at the end of the episode here. We, uh, we did a lot of remodeling to that, uh, to Flosten over there. So, uh, we'll see how that goes. But I wanted to see if this would actually take the vehicle color, which it doesn't look like it does. It's starting to carry some passengers. But I'm thinking... I'm thinking... Oh my goodness, look, look, look at all that oil over there. Wow, okay. Lots of refined oil and fuel. So we need to start doing something with that stuff. Alright. Very, very good. All right. But what I was thinking is that we might electrify the the this backbone route and throw some machine consents on there. And uh, see how that goes. See how that increases our passenger capacity because I think we have we have the passengers. Well, you guys just picked up a bunch, but there's still a lot there. Um, this is building up passengers pretty good. But if we can get these cities to grow, we can really. Uh, we can really start moving some passengers around. All right, but uh, that is a plan for another time. So for now, we'll end the episode here. So hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Go ahead, like, subscribe, and comment, and I will see you next time.